young like can do. So let's let's see how this one plays out. Let's see what things he do, does differently than Supergirl Kel. It's definitely a mixture of the projectiles and the edge guarding that make this real tough for 6WX's secondary in Cinero. But Sonic also has to face a similar problem, right? And especially in this game with, again, the shield cancel out of Spin Dash being gone. When you press that side B, you have to be sure that either you're going to clank out a projectile and just, you know, neutralize the situation, or you're going to be able to catch those desirable wish whiff punishes on Young Link for trying. Yeah. And you saw right there that he just wanted to end that stop with the dare. Oh, oh air dodging all stage. Not a that is not good for a lot of characters, but Sonic's up B allowed him to get a lot of vertical height right there, making that a good option for this character. Yeah, he can kind of tempt fate just from how far he gets back. And 6WX actually on the back foot with percent right now, but all the stage control in the world. Oh, couldn't pass through him. I think that he wanted to like run through, forward tilt the other way. And what happened? I don't the know. The air dodge? I think he may have air dodged and stuck in a lot of lag. Maybe air dodge because he wanted to text the stage because he did hit the stage right before. It's very possible. Either way, Colonies going to drop the first stock here, but so close to finishing it off. That looked like a nair on the way down. And 6 is going to lose his stock. Super close right now. Landing up air one. Not going to turn into anything. I think he was turned the wrong way for the up tilt. If that even would have comboed in the first place. I think it would have. Got you have to get him off. Yeah. And he's been dodging the boomerangs here and there. Now, and I want to see a lot more arrows from Colonies. Because I don't think Six, other than just staying in shield, has a real answer to like the, the end lag of arrows. Because they just, they're basically nothing. Could do it out of short up and get a lot of conversions with Young Lynch, as we saw from Tweak earlier today. So. Nice Nair, out of disadvantage. And the homing attack again. Oh, the hypnotizing S smash. Oh, that forward air. Really close to killing for Colonies here, but not enough over and over again. Young Link, a character with a lot of setups, but not a lot of raw kill power. Yeah, he he basically needs to like confront into one of these setups, and which comes from his projectile that he needs from like mid-screen. Oh, the trade, dash attack, and arrow, I believe. But there we go. Sonic leaning back with that forward smash. So deceptive. Yeah, and that takes the second stock of Colonies. And double parry. Good job to six. Oh, using yeah, the down air yeah. and the reduced landing like, to yeah. alter the way he's getting back on the stage. That was really creative. Yeah, definitely mixed Colonies up. He was not prepared for that situation. Just got a pivot grab from Colonies. Let's see what he can do. Let's see if he can end this stock out. Young Link not known to take stocks, but the dash attack taking it right there. All these Link's dash attacks are so strong. I just can't believe it. Yeah, they're definitely really good moves. And I missed the old Link dash attack, the one it was before Smash 4, which is now Young Link's in this game. Same as Melee. Really good move. All right, up. we're going to see up throw, up air. Okay. Yeah. Minor conversion right there. Now attacking on 33% on the six. And he's trying to get his footing back. Yeah, 6WX so scrappy at a disadvantage. Using a homing attack, you can tell it's a really good answer to situations like that. Especially yeah. because of how he like moves before launching the move. Yeah, if you saw right there, he used the homing attack just so he could dodge the boomerang. And because of the end lag from the boomerang, he was able to hit the homing attack. Some great parries on these landing fares from 6WX. Making Colonies keep himself on his toes. Yeah. And normally we'll see another conversion. Oh! But yeah. Wow, I thought that was the down air, but Sonic yeah. actually hit him first. Remember when you said that move doesn't work? One into two doesn't work so well, but if you hit just one of them, then, hey, man, I might be all you need. Yeah, look at it again right here. Oh, he did fall, okay, fall yeah, yeah, one yeah. into down air. And just barely, you see yeah. the horizontal range coming into play for 6WX. Sonic's up here, man was one of the best moves in Smash 4. Now it's a little bit less reliable, but still definitely has its place. Decently strong, really wide hitbox. Just again, it's a matter of will the first hit link into the second? Oftentimes no, but when it does, or if you just hit with the second hit, it could do exactly what you need it to. Yeah. Colonies, kind of a switch, have the music kind of big. All right, yep. I respect that. 
Give me dual zone. If you don't give me dual zone, I'm gonna be upset. Uh, production, can we tell Colonies to pick dual zone? Or get off the stream? No. <laughs> Motion denied. Alright, well, so, no. well, that's fine. <laughs> oh my god, also just want to shout out AF Pizza coming through <laughs> with the, the catered food. On on the way here, um, yeah. oh man, I forget what kind of business it was. I was, again, so tired. Probably shouldn't have even driven with how tired I was, but it was uh, TF something. <laughs> TF Welding or something, I think it was. <laughs> I was like, man, that's a great name in the late 20 teens. Why just take it? <laughs> yeah, they, they probably already had that for years, you know, yeah. and it's just like now it's culturally relevant. All right, anyway, going into the second game. Whoa, a wolf switch from 6WX? Okay, didn't even know this was on the table, but yeah. I can't fault him, man. So many players picking up wolf. They've seen the success that players like Zachary have had. Even MK Leo with his, like, three- or four-day-old wolf um, taking the win at Heart of Battle. Yeah, putting him in a lot of work. And you saw him try to duck immediately, though he was faced around. Young Link's shield does block projectiles in this game. Yeah, it does. Gotta be standing or walking up. Or, uh, or crouching. Dunking. Yeah. Which was the animation he chose to start with. Right. Smart call here by Colonies, just knowing laser is very likely to come. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Closes okay. the stock with that. The up B. Okay, Colonies, you're nuts, bro. Yeah, I'm feeling this. Yeah. I was thinking the switch to Wolf from 6WX is smart just because, in terms of. On paper, right? Yeah. You've got a projectile to contest this character with. You've got a reflector to send his yeah. back. But what you don't have is a sword, and you don't have the ground movement that Young Link has. Of course, yeah. in the air, Wolf is a speed demon. But but you did say this guy, Colonies, does play with Sweet. That's all. Awesome. Sweet be one of the best wolves in the game, and the best Young Link. So he should probably know exactly what this matchup looks like from both ends, plus some of Tweak's advice. I don't want to like jump the gun and say they play together all the time or anything, but. I know they do live close in Ohio. Yeah. They've definitely played a substantially more than these two plays. Oh, yeah, for sure. And 6 wx man, really struggling to get something started here. Even if he gets this first kill, Wolf, really good combo game, but just need to see him create those openings. And I think he's a lot better at forcing them when he's playing from ahead and able to shoot the gun. See that down air, one of the best options out of disadvantage. Yeah, and he converted that off an arrow that he shot off stage. So this is one of the tools Young Link has that not the other Links have. The ability to combo his things with how fast he is across stage. So out of disadvantage, falling up air, I believe, takes 6WX to like a, even more close to evening it out. Yeah, we've seen stuff like uh, Tweak going for a short hop arrow, yeah. jump arrow again, up B or down arrow or whatever. Even so like full hop arrows, like three of them yeah. shot at one point. Yeah, this character definitely has some stuff, both in terms of genuine keep away and turning those little projectile hits into much more. We see Colony's putting that on full display right now. I think we're going to see 6WX forced back onto Sonic. But that first match was so close, potentially yeah. too close for comfort, which is why we saw the wolf come out in the first place. So, Colony's just all over him. And the Nair. The insane amount of offstage pressure. And again, that's really where Wolf suffers, right? The distance of his recovery, not so great. And if you're able to stuff it out on startup, you've probably already knocked him too far for him to come back. That one just being a straight up kill, though. Sending him all the way out to the blast zone. And we're going to see Colonies even up the set. So, what do you think is going to happen? You think we're going to get the return? Of to Sonic? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I certainly don't think we're going to see Incineroar. And I'd be a little bit surprised to see him stick with Wolf. Sonic got him the one game that he did win, so that's probably probably the move. To the third and final game of the set and there's this okay this is also winter semis wow we got a lot of you know what maybe it's because once you make it to winners finals you auto advance is that why i've only been seeing winter semis i believe so i want to believe that but i'm not you know, exactly sure the guy to ask is right here so give me a sec 
All right, yeah, my, my hunch was correct. So um, winter semis, if you win, you're out of the woods. So um, we may see the player who drops here make a return yeah. for loser's bracket qualifiers, but um, that's why all the matches have been winter semis of their pools to this point. Two, one, go! All right, here goes back to the Sonic, the tried and true for 6WX here. We've seen him play this character to great success, of course, uh, over the course of two Smash games now. To yeah. See exactly how far it's going to get him, and Polonies is going to be too difficult to break through right now. I mean, after a, a great opening from 6WX, Colonies responded immediately with like twice as much damage. Yeah, and he basically gave him momentum with that wolf. Oh, yeah, he, he really did. I agree. Yeah, the wolf pick definitely allowed Colony to find his footing and get his ground. Gave him the confidence he needed to go as far. Up tilt. Love the cross up with that yeah. neutral air, too. Now Six just trying to find the stock, going deep, but missing it right there. That backer was so close to hitting Colonies, too. But you see, he's able to just respond to the shield pressure, neutral airs out of shield, pick up some more conversions, arrows into normals. Like, man, this character does a lot. And like you were saying, Reggie, before the game came out, a lot of people had really high hopes for Young Link. I think Colony still has very high hopes for this yeah. character. He's making me have hopes for this character right now. He mains uh, Fox and Smash 4, so you know this guy's not here to trifle with a character that's yeah. not great. And again, I thought that was sick. I just put him on stage. <laughs> and going off with that fair. All right, 6 wx what kind of combo, I'm sorry, comeback can you make here? Is this it? Yes, it is. 2-1 lead. And 6 a full stock behind, though. Yeah, this is not the character to be making a full stock comeback, especially against someone with projectiles who doesn't have to worry about all these full screen whiff punishes, right? It's going to take you a lot of time to get over to where he's shooting the projectiles from. Coming out with the fair, but Six just knowing what to do. And uh, those parries. Dude, I may have spoken too soon. 6WX looking really clean right now. Colonies, we getting a little bit nervous, just eager to close it out. Yeah. This will be a big win for him. I think this is his first major out-of-state tournament. Yeah, I believe so. In ultimate. Uh, yeah. So he did go to Frostbite from one of them, but I'm not sure. Oh, yes, he did. He did. But first still. out of region. Yeah, Ohio to Michigan, not the biggest yeah. trek you can make. And we got 6WX, man, making a crazy comeback right now. Got to pick up a down throw for that stage control. He had a really unfavorable angle. Is that it? No. Wow, so close, though. Colony's definitely tightening up after that one, and needs to tighten up his gameplay. Yeah, Six only was take, had 27% when he took that stock, and he was a full stock behind. This is virtually even, Max. We're going to see that homing attack used to infiltrate Colony's space. He's just trying to sit back, get some of his projectiles out, get the conversions off of them. And he can combo off of all three of his projectiles. Man. Yeah. Bomb go being the slowest to start up. Right. So we don't see him pull out as much as the others. Oh, and I like that from 6WX just dancing around, trying to make his follow-up ambiguous off the tech chase. But Colony's just looking so solid right now. Yeah. Is he going to be able to seal the deal? That's the real question here. 6WX, a lot of experience in these high-profile tournaments like this. See if Colonies is going to crack or if he's going to be able to pull it off. Let's see what's going on. Nice air dodge. I love how he's checking in with yeah. arrows, though, knowing that he can get follow-ups off of it, yeah. knowing that even if he can't, still just going to pop him up, put him at that unfavorable angle. Yeah, he does not want to give Six anything for free. Oh, we saw the ledge drop right there. Would be nice to work out, and there, there we go. Colony is going to close that over 6WX. I'd say that's a slight upset. Uh, yeah. 6WX just like the other Sonic players again, still trying to find his stride in Ultimate, figure the character out, uh, and of course he's received some objective detriments yeah. from, uh, coming out of Smash 4. He's definitely been downgraded in one really important area, which yeah. is the shield cancel spin dash. I think that also particularly hurts his matchup against projectile-based characters like Young Link. So um, we're seeing him still kind of doing a little bit of soul searching, both in yeah. terms of characters as well as his actual play style. Colonies, meanwhile, fully backing Young Link, making content about the character, posting Twitter clips, you know. He showing definitely what to seemed do. to love the character. Yeah, I do too, man. I'm thinking about putting a little more time behind him. I don't think it's for you, but you know. 
All right, man. Get, you know. get out of here. He's got a sword. That's good enough. <laughs> All right, but anyway, guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed our block. Um, I'll be seeing you guys a little later tonight. Um, yeah, same with me. I believe I'll have another block later today. Word. Uh, but for now, we're going to be hopping off, move into some singles wave B action yeah. for 3 p.m. Uh, I'll be playing as well. So it's been real. I'll tie with you. That's fine. Okay. Cool. Um, again, that's this thing, guys. I, 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 I don't always know why. win. I don't know. No, you've tied with me twice today. Time, so time wise that, that's a win in my book. Anyway, guys, thank you again for watching Collision 2019. We'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Right.
Cena. Vamos. 